Guys, it's Mama Shanais. The UN has brought half of the Palestinian women and children that Israel is accused of killing back to life. Is it magic? Is it a miracle? Crazy stuff. Here's the scoop. On May 6th, the UN published data showing that over 9,500 women and over 14,500 children had been killed in Gaza. Then, just two days later on May 8th, the UN once again published data. Only this time, the numbers showed that 4,959 women and 7,797 children had been reportedly killed in Gaza. It's important to note that both the old numbers and the new numbers came to the UN from Hamas-controlled sources. It's also important to remember that according to a report last month, the Gaza Health Ministry could not account for thousands of names of the deceased. It's no secret that the UN has a very clear bias against Israel. They have been accepting the death toll from this war at face value from Hamas, a terrorist organization that has no problem lying to demonize Israel. They do it all the time. The UN's acceptance of Hamas's death count without proper investigation has added to the overwhelming rise in anti-Semitism all over the world, as Israel and Jews everywhere have been accused of committing genocide. The UN has been negligent, to say the least, in their acceptance and their reporting of these numbers. And who suffers the consequences? The Jewish people. Shame on the UN once again.